Good morning, everybody. It's a bright, beautiful, cool morning this morning, which is unusual. It's going to get up to, what, 91 today? 91, 93. And we're going up in the hills about two and a half hours up to Mountain View, so it'll be probably 10 degrees cooler up there. We'll go, tell them what we're going up there for. Uh, C10 truck show. And there sets his C10, and are we taking the C10? Nope. Why are we not taking the C10, Kevin? Because it doesn't have air conditioning. <laughs> That's right. That's right. I'm sorry. I know that's pitiful, but uh, when you get to a certain age and you, you need the creature comforts, I told him all summer, get the air, get the air. And he's don't just. Need no air. He, he doesn't use our air. It could be 100 degrees. He drives my car without me in it. The AC is not on. So, what do you do? You go to a car show in the car with air conditioning. That's what you do. Well, we'll go. Here's my thing. He's got to change his, his rims and tires, and then I'll go with him anywhere. But I don't like the rims that came with this truck. So, AC and rims. Gotcha. Gotcha. See y'all up there. As we're headed up here to this car show and not being in the 85 I have my eye on a 65 GMC that's down the road now I like the 60s what do you think do you like the 60s I, I really like I really like the uh, the early 70s trucks I mean, I graduated in 77, and I really, you know, that was the hot truck. Chevrolet trucks, GMC trucks, you know, the, you had your hot rod truck back in the day. That's what we did. We we weren't about fancy sports cars. I mean, I guess some of the rich kids was, but, you know, it was pickup trucks. And 
that's just the nostalgia of I guess the 70s truck uh, the truck that we have out in our yard that belongs to a friend of ours it just kills me to see it sitting out there because it's a what 74 no it's a 77 yeah it's the year it's the year I graduated truck and, uh, it is a long wheelbase and I'm not about a long wheelbase but uh, you better hurry up and come get it I'm gonna start fixing it up <laughs> that's all I got to say <laughs> but uh, hopefully we'll see a big variety up here at this show now I do like the trucks from the 30s and the 40s. I don't know what year it is. I think 38 or something like that. The ones with the 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 extra window on the side, the round glass. You know, it's a really really small cab. Two people. You know, three three. You better know each other. You're gonna know each other really well if you put three people in one of them cabs. But uh, hopefully, we'll see a big variety of all of the years out here. I don't know. It's you know, it's a pretty small little town uh, it is a beautiful drive no matter which way you come to get up here there's several different ways from if you're coming from the north or from the south it's just a beautiful drive it's a slow drive if you get behind a logging truck so just know that you need to just pull over and you know wait 30 minutes and maybe you won't catch up with them but uh, odds are you will but that's just the way it is up here in, in the hills as part of living in Arkansas I guess but I like the earlier trucks his 85 is okay and it's okay with me because it's a step sign if it was just a straight truck I don't think I would uh, I don't think I'd really be into it, it he he likes it I mean and it, you know it's okay but to, that's the year my uh, oldest son was born and so that's okay too but I prefer older older uh, the square bodies that's what this is right it's just a square body see well I know everybody will be there probably but it's a C10 sponsored uh, show and uh, the square they're okay but boy I like the other ones too so hopefully we'll see some beauties